This is a VTV production. Welcome back, Bears. I'm Jocelyn. And I'm Daniel, reporting from the VTV studio. Today is Tuesday, October 18th, and today is National Chocolate Cupcake Day. So what's your favorite? Chocolate caramel, peanut butter chocolate, devil's food, chocolate mint, or chocolate with pecans? So many choices. How about our Bears football team? They kept the winning tradition going on Friday as Avron Carter, Jason Love, and Nathan Tony each scored twice, while Aaron DeBose and Armando Acevedo each scored once in the 59-0 win against the Stevens Falcons. In Friday's win, Devin Thompson also scored with a 35-yard field goal the defense kept up the pressure all night, with Manuel Lara coming up with an interception. BFND Bears. Attention AP students. If you are not able to attend the registration, there are makeup sessions for AP exam registration. Continues today through Friday, October 21st in the library during lunches. Bring your Chromebook. And remember, this will be your last opportunity to register. And congrats again to our Varsity Lady Bears cross-country team for taking gold. First place at the district cross-country meet this past Tuesday. Both in the Varsity Bears cross-country team, the district runner-up, Duke Silver, will compete in the regional meet on October 24th in Corpus Christi. Sadly, our Lady Bears volleyball team fell to the Stevens Lady Falcons this past Friday. Let's wish them well today against the Delta Mayor Lady Wildcats at the Northside Sports Gym at 5.30 p.m. BFND Lady Bears. Bears, the homecoming game is October 28th versus Holmes, and the 2022 homecoming dance is October 29th from 7.30 p.m. to 10.30 p.m. in the cafeteria. The theme is House on Haunted Hill. Tickets are on sale for $25. Guests from other campuses are permitted, but all guests need approval forms before the last ticket is sold. They are available in the VPO or in front of A204 and are due by this Friday, October 21st by 4.30 p.m. Bears, the Brennan String Department will have its fall concert tomorrow in the Brennan Auditorium. Doors will open at 6.45 with performances by the Brennan Varsity Guitars, the JV Orchestra, Varsity Orchestra, and Symphonic Strings. This past Saturday, the Brennan Boys and Girls Water Polo teams competed in the UIL area round of playoffs. Our Bears team played hard but came up short against a strong Alamo Heights team ending their season with an 8-2-1 and one record. It was a great season. Our Lady Bears team came out strong against Clark and went on to win 12-7. to Congrats to our area champs. They will compete at the regional quarterfinals against health careers. They compete today at 5.15 p.m. at the Northside Swim Center at the Ferris Complex. BFND Lady Bears. Bears, once more, let's congratulate our Bears tennis teams for defeating Laredo United South last Tuesday, 10-5, to in their bi-district match. And last Thursday, they won their area match 10-2 over Harlingen. Let's wish them well today in Corpus Christi for round three in their playoffs. BFND Bears. Here's a huge shout out to our Brennan Marching Band for scoring all ones this past Saturday at the UIL Region 29 Marching Contest and earning sweep six, which is the highest rating a band can receive. Way to play on, BMB. Finally, kudos to our Lady Bears basketball team who held their annual costume practice with coaches participating as Dunkin' Donuts. But they can't wait until their season begins. Well, this is all we have for today, and don't forget to follow us on Twitter at BTV Bears. If you missed any part of this broadcast, catch us on YouTube by searching for BTV Bears. If you have any announcements for BTV, please email Mr. Serna at fernando.serna at nasd.net. I'm Jocelyn, signing off from BTV. Have a great day, Bears, and remember, tomorrow is early release day. And I'm Daniel. Remember, success hinges heavily on a positive mindset, so stay engaged in your learning, Bears. This is a BTV production.